WAWV Live at 5. Well, welcome back. Here's a quick look at today's local headlines. Jordan Johnson is back with us to talk about a plan to increase the pay and responsibilities of the Vigo County School Corporation's head of communication. That idea has been scrapped. This after the Vigo County School Superintendent says there was public outcry. She found out why the plan was considered and what happens now. Jordan. Thanks, Sadie. Superintendent Rob Hayworth tells me this new role was meant to grow enrollment and retain students. I thought I was bringing a solution, not creating a greater problem, and that's really what I don't want to do. Vigo County School Superintendent Rob Hayworth says the Director of Communications position at the school corporation is currently manager level and pays $87,000 a year. A recent plan would have made this position a director level job, up the pay and added duties that include growing the student population. Hayworth said director level pay is no less than $127,000 per year. Hayworth acknowledged the plan met with backlash from the community. A demonstration against the move was organized on social media. Bill Riley is the head of communications for VCSC. He was hired in 2019. Hayworth says the plan to increase the duties and pay of this position came after the December 14th school board meeting where a discussion was held on declining student enrollment. That did not happen overnight. The solution to that problem will not happen overnight. VCSC received $6,600 of state funding per student. The board learned at that December meeting there are 850 students in Vigo County who are not enrolled in VCSC, a potential loss of $5.6 million of state funding. Had Riley's duties been expanded, Hayworth says he thought student enrollment would have grown. The excellence, innovation, and creativity shown by our current head of communications is why I thought he could lead this initiative moving forward. Hayworth says it's too early to know what the next steps will be to increase student enrollment, but he announced a plan to improve communication among the school board and public. He'll be requesting the first school board meeting of each month be a public's work meeting. Things such as job descriptions, policy development, and student enrollment will be discussed those days. I believe that will improve communication around all issues, both internal and external. Superintendent Hayworth plans to meet with the board president tomorrow. Sadie.